The bungee run comes with a pink tarp and folds just like any other tarp. It'll just be a little bit longer as um, the bungee run is one of our longer units. The tarp will be a little bit bigger than the unit. It just gives you a nice estimate of uh, how big of a space you'll need to set up the moonwalk. Now it will come with four nails. Uh, you just need to uh, nail down each corner of the tarp. Make sure the washer is also on there. These are the four washers. Make sure the nails go completely in the ground to avoid uh, kids stubbing their toes or just uh, any possible injury on the nail. Unrolls from the back to the front. So just make sure that you have the new mop uh, toward the back of the tarp before you start unrolling it. There will be two tubes on the bungee run. Um, we, it comes with one bowler. Make sure you attach one of the tubes to a bowler and that the other tube is tied off uh, so it will inflate properly. Before you bow it up, you want to make sure that all the flaps and zippers, uh, I believe there are three of them, are closed so it will inflate all the way. It takes about two minutes for this one. This unit comes with eight nails in all, four for the tarp and four for the unit. There will be tethers on uh, each of the four corners of this moonwalk. And you'll take a nail and a washer and um, nail each tether down. Make sure the nail is all the way in the ground to prevent injury or uh, stub toes on all the nails. The bungee run comes with a bag of all the accessories that you need. Um, it comes with two brackets, two footballs, and two vests and two bungee boards. To attach the brackets to the moonwalk, uh, one side will be slightly longer than the other. It's not very noticeable, but you should be able to tell. Um, you slide the longer side into the loops first, and the shorter sides should be able to slide in pretty easily. There are two plates on the brackets, and uh, a bar that connects both the plates together in the middle. Make sure that the plates are facing the moonwalk and the bar is sticking on the outside. Then you're going to take the bungee cord, stick it through the hole, and then on the other side there will be a carabiner, and you attach the carabiner to the middle rod of the bracket. Once the bungee cord is through the loop and attached to the bracket, you take the other carabiner and you attach it to the back of the vest.